from the noisiest neighborhood in the known universe. Welcome to Smoky Goodness 2.0, YouTube's bison-centric barbecue and grilling channel. We're gonna be doing elk today. Uh, today is, speaking of today, today is Mother's Day. And we're going to treat Mrs. Smoky Goodness to a Mother's Day feast. We've got some Hassleback potatoes. I'll be stuffing them with all kinds of good stuff, including elk bratwurst, uncured elk bratwurst. Of course, from Good Life Premium Meats, a division of Nebraska Bison. Brought to you by Nebraska Bison, always. All bison, all the time. Anyway, we're also gonna do a couple of little tiny steaks for her. Um, these things are small. One of them's bacon wrapped. Mm, gonna be good. So without any more further subjective delaying ado, I think we should get started. Mr. Smoky Goodness, why do you always do the prep in your kitchen? Would you prep on a table like this? No, you wouldn't. Storm damage from two years ago. This tree back behind me was also uh, part of what destroyed this table out here. This kind of uh, used to be what I used to prep on. It's just an old beat up picnic table. Ah, don't use it anymore. Big chunk of it missing. Because part of this tree, the wind knocked down and uh, I mean, it landed all over the neighbor's yard, all over their yard. Uh, the majority of it ended up on this table. And something else really weird happened. Uh, the same tree that uh, succumbed to the wind two years ago also succumbed to a bolt of lightning just not too long ago. The bark is beginning to peel off of this tree and uh, I'm starting to worry when this thing's gonna fall. I'll probably push it with one finger pretty soon. It's gonna fall over and create another mess for us to clean up. Or maybe I'll get one of those sculptors to do kind of a totem pole thing out here on this tree. That would be cool. Okay, all that being said, everything began with a single flame and then later we'll begin with another single flame. I don't like these fire starters. They take forever to get going. Stick around. I really wanted to use some taser rub on this, but uh, on these taters, but I didn't have one of the ingredients with which to make it, so you can't go wrong with Midnight Espresso, Tango Spice. Some Vermont seriously sharp cheddar cheese. Seriously sharp. Mm-hmm.
rocking along at 300 degrees in the grill dome. All right. And there you go. The second portion of our pig's mission is about to begin now. Ah, oh, these coals. I do not like this brand. B&B. The burning right here, nothing out here. I lit these things about probably 45 minutes ago. So, uh, I'm just gonna have to dance between the coals, I guess. And while those petite little steaks are searing, let's check on our Hasselbacks. Fortunately, I'll say fortunately, I always carry a, a toothpick with me out here to the stage. Not close. Well, wait. It's starting to get a little soft. Not quite there yet, though. Yeah, about halfway. No one's in a rush. A few minutes has passed. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. I don't like the way the uh, bacon is unraveling. They had these plastic inserts, I guess you could call them, plastic pins holding the bacon on. Plastic and fire do not get along, so I pulled them, pulled them off. And well, <laughs> these are gonna be done real soon, real soon. A couple of minutes has passed. I really would like to set these on their sides and kind of crisp up that bacon a little bit, but I think it's gonna remain where it's supposed to be. So, I'll just do the uh, standard operating procedure. Just be really, really careful. Oh boy, those are, they're smelling good. Be ready a long time before the Hasselbacks are, but that's okay. See you in a bit. <laughs> Shut up, bird. The steaks that I am cooking for Mrs. Smoky Goodness are just about done. So uh, let's get back into uh, Pitmaster Realm and check it out. And of course, they smell like they are. Oh yeah, that's about medium. If you, look at that, <laughs> these birds are attacking me. If you would like a 10% discount on your first purchase uh, from NebraskaBison.com, uh, Good Life Premium Meats as well. Uh, make sure to use the uh, code Smoky Goodness at checkout. S M O K E Y G W O N E W -S, S. Smoky Goodness, just like the channel spelled. And you'll get 10% off your first purchase. Sounds like a pretty good deal to me. I'd do it. When you know your pit well, it'll do exactly what you want. We are at 90 minutes mission elapsed time. Check on these taters. See how tender they are. Oh yeah, it's going in like butter. Until the toothpick breaks. It's a cheap toothpick. See how small it is? Oh, those are perfect. So, these are done. Let's check on the steaks. And our steaks. Just the way she likes them. A little north of medium well. Well, no, I'd say medium well. That's how she likes them. That's how she gets them. Give you the wide perspective here. All right. In you go. Woohoo! How does it taste there, Smoky Goodness family? Mine is delicious! So is mine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is ex ex excellent. Happy Mother's Day to the most wonderful hot wife on the planet. Thank you very much. Oh, this Thanks is to my family. That's us. <laughs> These are good. I think these are better than the last time. 
I say that every time, but anyway, I'll see you next time.